Welcome to Kiwi's Channel. Hope you enjoy it. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Luciano, who was in room 107? Oh, he owns a big plumbing supply company. Huh? How appropriate. Because, well, the toilet is clogged again. Yeah, I know you just got the elevator fixed, but you're gonna need to call the plumber. I don't know what happened in there, but it is definitely beyond my skill set. Closing again, Charlie. What do I have to do? Get you one of those posture, correcting back brace. Sorry, Mrs. Centola. Don't forget, you represent this hotel. And come on now, we all care about the hotel. I think Charlie understands, don't you, Charlie? Two sure things, boss. And two things I could have been on the tropical island right now sit here and trying to make something of this hotel and I love you for it now where are you lovely ladies off to? shopping um, okay have fun hey I had a thought why not bring along This is the hotel lobby. Ah, my dad, the voice of this hotel. Yes, the man can sing. Who's that on the phone, princess? My followers, dad. Who's following you? Only 10,000 people on Snapgram. I bet they would love to hear you sing, dad. So these people all love you? They love us. It also means you get some exposure, Mr. Musician. I'm proud of you, princess. Oh, daddy, no sure I've got a hotel to run and you should test out that new repair factor. Ah, that remind me, I've got to call the plumber. Hey, out of bones, my last breakup was only months ago. 
which is four times as long and couldn't seem less, as I recall. Well, what about you, princess? Uh, I am friendly off the market and not interested in anything or anyone but so and his guests. Who has time for romance, anyway? There's the plumber. I'm almost done with my sieve. I'll be right with you, sir. Well, this is a first. What do you want me to do with it? I can kill it, got no problem killing fox. One knock on the head with a pipe wrench and... No! Poor little frog has been stuck for I don't know how long. Somebody needs to take care of this little fella. Can I keep him, Dad? You don't want a hamster? No. Maybe a goldfish? Froggy. I think I call him Froggy. Okay, princess, but maybe you should give him a bag. When you feel lost and alone, you're not on your own. Together it's Bella Vita. As seasons pass us by, through good and bad times, together it's better. Copycat, that's my routine. But you might have better luck at the bar. Hey, it was a good idea. You've got a lot of toes? Sure do. Well, it's about time you had the chance to put this idea of yours into action. You don't me dragging you down. You don't drag me. What are you talking about? Your first day coming up soon. Yes. I've already got the paperwork done. The keys to the kingdom will be yours. Dad? I'll still be here to support you, as I promise. But I'm looking forward to playing some more piano and seeing what you do with the place. You are just like your nono. He had a knack for the hotel business, and so do you. It's too much. It's your chance to give this hotel the happy ever after it's deserved. This is... This is everything.
So join me in congratulating our future queen of the castle who ascend the throne in just five days. Sing along if you know the words. It's not mine yet, Dad. The papers are done. All we need is my signature on your birthday. Congratulations, do you do a wonderful job. You already taken on such a strong role here. Thanks, Gary. Ever since I was a little girl, I dream of running this place. I remember you were such a funny little thing with your camera and your to-do list, putting breadcrumb in the garden to have pencil and greater find the hotel. Speaking of the good old days, do you know what I did last night? Um, uh, no. I watched ten straight hour of Fred Astaire and Ginger Rogers movie. They were having a marathon. Really? You know I used to dance ballet, even walk with George Balanchine. But Charlie sure has some moves. Thanks for watching.